Hey there, Doug with uh, Doug's DIY Power and More. Today I drove into work. It is a winter day and my work only offers these 110 volt outlets. So I brought in my EcoFlow Delta Pros for another reason so what I'm going to do is I'm going to plug them in the tubity outlets and see if I can run the dual voltage hub and charge it 240 volts let me get set up all right so I'm bringing both units up to the same percentage of charge we're at 99 and 100 on that one. Probably well, see it from the side. The charger keeps ramping up and down. When this is done charging, I'll connect the double double voltage hub. And then switch my EV charger from the 110 outlet these and deplete the power into the car now my car is sitting at 51 volt percent state of charge um, between these two it's 7200 watts it's a 16 amp charger so 3600 watts should take two hours to discharge and that will give me most of the power I need to get back. I will say, I noticed that you can't use a double voltage hub with AC plugged in because it gives off a little smoke. So we'll see if uh, this even works at all. I know this says 16 minutes, but it was at 9 minutes a few minutes ago. So, I don't think that is accurate at all. We just clicked off to 100%, so I'm going to hook up the hub. Alright, so the hub is hooked up. I'm going to hit the button on the hub. Beep, beep. Check. Make sure there's no odd smoke anything so it's 100% 100% all right so here's the test I'm going to use the 620 plug pull this out a little bit to disable the charge or all the way Take my 110 volt adapter off, and then we're going to plug it in. All right, we're plugged in. It says we got 200 volts. Now, plugged in. Says we're pulling 3.4 kilowatts, 3.9, 1800 from this, 1800 from that. All right. So it's charging. So it works with the double voltage chub. No ground neutral bond needed with this charger here. Accurate estimates of two hours. Let's 
smelling for odd smells. All right, I'll be back with an update shortly. Quick update, and we have pulled about 4.389 kilowatts out. It says we've got 31% remaining on that one and 31% on that one. Seems to be running pretty well. I'll be back when it's done. All right, so I'm back and the system has shut off. And we are zero percent on one and four percent on the other. So I'm gonna unplug this. see where what percentage the car is at oh, 78 miles eighty four percent that's a a lot of mileage for 84%. So I was at 50, 51% or 40, 49 to 51% when I got here. My Leaf Spy shows me at 17.2 kilowatts. Now I will plug the car back into the 110 and let it get as far up as I can before I leave but yeah so successfully added roughly 7.2 kilowatts actually into the car pretty happy with that result expensive items for uh, what they do but in the next video on these items I will show how I'm going to use them as a true backup so don't forget to like and subscribe and um, stay tuned for the next one